Hi friends, in this video I am going to show you how to implement BCD to 7 segment decoder display using 4511 common cathode display. Okay, so first you have to simulate the circuit. So you have to click on this schematic capture, then this window will appear as you can see here. So now you have to pick your devices. So here we have required 4511. 4511 IC so here we have this one is a CMOS 7 segment BCD to 7 segment slash decoder this IC we have required so you have to click on this double click on it then that would be it, it would be selected right now here and then we have a required uh, resistor okay so now we are pick resistor so this register yeah so you can see here the, the, the we can select it here and we have a required seven segment display so seven segment so here we have a three type of display so i am selecting seven segment common cathode display right red this one okay so you have to double click on this then it would be selected right now here and we have a required logic states okay so logic state so we are writing here okay so here we have a logic probe and logic logic state and logic probe so we have selected right now here okay now you have to click on this okay now we are simulating so you have to first select this IC okay and then uh, we have a 7 segment cathode display so you have to single click on it so then it would be selected right now here so I am selecting and then uh, we have a logic state so this one is first logic and then this it would be second and third and this one is fourth okay so I am selecting this all to yeah so you can see here these are the four input which uh, I am giving to this IC okay and then we have a required resistor so I am taking here resistor first and I just rotate this clockwise and then you have to block copy okay, okay so we have required here four resistor okay so this one you could be selected here okay and then you have to attach this input to this bar first and then second is to this third one may be connect would be connected with this and the fourth input would be connected with this okay so and you can see here so the output pins would be connected directly with this output of 4511 IC so here we have a seven outputs so I am writing here seven outputs I'm joining the, these seven outputs to this uh, seven segment and then uh, we have required a ground so I am taking here a ground so the ground would be I am selecting this here okay so you have to select this here and this resistor you can see first one this resistor would be connected with this 
this one to the second this one to the third and this one I'm this is the fourth resistor so we are just okay so I am taking this to here right now so then it would be connected to the ground and this also connected to the ground this also connected to the ground and this also connected to this ground and your last uh, LE pin would be connected also to the ground okay so here we have a DC source required so we are selecting here DC source so this one is a DC source so I am selecting right now here and you have to connect this this and also connect it with this okay so both are connected now you have to select this 5 volts okay so I am selecting here 5 volts now you have to click on ok and sorry I just replace this I am selecting again this uh, and you have to put this here and then it this pin would be connected with this and also this okay so and uh, this one is a uh, 5 volts okay now you can see here uh, our simulation is now ready so now you have to run this simulation then you can see here 0 okay so if this is 1 then you can see here 2 okay if both are 1 then you can see 3 okay and then if all are zeros uh, so sorry all are zeros then you can see here 1 if this one is 0 this one is 1 then you can see here 2 if both are then you can see here 3 okay and then if both are 0 and then it w this one is 1 then you can see here 4 if this is 1 then you can see 5 okay and this is 0 and this is 1 then you can see here 6 and you can see here uh, you can see here if both are 1 then you can see here this is 7 if both are if all are 0 then you can see here 7 8 okay so hope you learn uh, hope you understand this simulation if you have any question any query then you can ask in the comment section below thank you so much for watching